everyone and welcome back to our channel for today's video i'm gonna start the travel vlog for this holiday 2023 and for this first travel vlog of our family we had to Dalaman, Turkey, specifically in Mars. So for today's video, I'm gonna share our long travel. It's kind of long already because it's four hours travel and our flight is in the afternoon and we will arrive in Turkey for like, I think it's 11 p.m. And then we needed to travel more from the Dalaman airport going to Marmaris which is like one and a half hour so it depends on the flight if it's not delayed or what so we are traveling with our two kids one is four year old and one is ten months so we are lucky because we chose the time when they are about to sleep so I'm gonna share to you what it is to travel with the kids and for the next series of the vlogs we will make it like a series because it's long I will share to you what we did and what we experienced how much we saved and what are the things that we didn't save so yeah there are a lot of unexpected expenses in Turkey so you better really have a spare money or if you are stick to your budget just keep on watching my blog because I will show you how to save and how to avoid an unexpected expenses we chose to go April 16 so which is still kind of cold here in the UK but there it's already going 18 degrees to 20 degrees which is already hot and because there are kids we don't want really to go on the peak season which is the summer who might be really goes to maybe 30 degrees it may be hard for them and it might be hard for us to roam around so 18 degrees to 20 degrees is just right temperature so first hint for you to save on travels is by using some app of the merchandise which is sometimes they have this partner offers so partner offers means they have a partner shops that offers discount when you use their app so for example with Lidl there's a lot of coupons that you can use on shopping but also there is like a partner tab which you can get a discount in cinema or some kids activities and with us good thing we found this that they have a discount code for jet to holidays so we chose jet to holidays on the whole trip so with jet to holidays we chose the all-inclusive we went to club alice so that's our hotel so from breakfast to dinner including um, snacks are free and the coaster for the pickup and pick up from the airport and then hotel to the to go going to airport when you're going home is included also so the total of our bill is like 800 something but because of that legal partnership offer with um, jet 2 we had a savings of 65 what? pounds so it became 797 only so that's nine nights for two adults and two kids kids are free so let's start it now and i will show you what went on our first day you don't like it daan, daan. school school kid we arrived in Manchester Airport. So, of course, we are here also for TikTok transitions Sorry. of our travels. Later, we will get up, okay? Uh, 
So we are early. What's important here with kids are you should have snacks. So you don't need to buy snacks in the airport. So kids will snack before the flight and during the flight for sure. Belifa lost her ribbon. So, of course, on going to the airplane, you know that no. it's allowed to have um, water Rifa. for the baby. Rifa. So, you just Rifa. always put it on a Ziploc bag. So, good thing with the Manchester Airport, there's a free Ziploc bag. So, along our stay in the airport, we didn't get bored because there's a lot of people who talk to us because of the kids. So we met a Saudi and um, Indians. They are really very kind. For the airport outfit, it's nice to have pockets so you can put all your like passport, boarding, paper, and um, you needed to have at least a jacket because you don't know if it will be hot in the plane or cold in the plane because we are shifting from cold weather to hot weather and for me it works that i have this body bag because i can easily just put our boarding passes and um, passport because you know it's in and out they keep on checking it and then you will need to keep it again and then they will check it again so it's easier to take it out rather than the backpack so the flight should take off at 4.45 and that is nap time of Ganifa and Gustav which is the perfect time and then we will arrive there in Deen which is their bedtime. This is Ganifa's reaction during the take off. It's so funny. I think she feel it. Now waiting for our luggages. So because it's dark, I didn't have a chance to video about the bus going to the hotel. So this is Club Alice, and this is how it looks like inside. What surprised us is Galifa has a crib, so she will have her own bed. First meal here because we arrived like 2 a.m. We just had the fries from the front shop. We had a good sleep because we lack of sleep. So we sleep like 3 a.m. And this is our first breakfast. So we really needed to wake up early to catch the first breakfast. And that's until 10 a.m. only. So, of course, because British goes here, there's always an English breakfast. I'm going to end the first part of the video now. There is no itinerary for the first day. So, we just roam around and we will share to you what we found out and how to roam around the Marmaris. So, yeah, if you are not subscribed yet, kindly please subscribe and click the notification bell. See you! Now, are you